fellow, whom do I see? I'm extremely glad. What brings you here? How do you do, Lamov? Thank you. And how do you do? Well, I get along somehow. But what do I see? You're in an evening dress. Evening dress, gloves and so on. Can you be going somewhere? <coughs> no, I've come only to see you. Still, you're so formal in your get-up. Actually, the fact is, I have come here to trouble you with a request. Don't go round and round. Spit it out. You alone can help me. I beg your pardon. He's come to board. Actually, I've come here to ask the hand of your daughter, Natalia. By Jove's! What did you say? I've come here. Oh, I've been waiting for this day for so long. And the day has come today. I'm off my balance. I'm completely off my balance. I'll just go and call her. Natalia! Natalia! I think I should make up my mind. If I look for an ideal match, I'd never get married. Natalia is an excellent housekeeper. Not so bad looking. Well educated. What else do I need? And I am already at the age of 40. And I have a lot of problems. I have heart palpitations, my right eyebrow twitches, and my foot goes to sleep. <coughs> well, dear, it's you. And Papa said, go there's a merchant come for his goods. How do you do, Lamo? Thank you. And how do you do, Anand Natalia? Well, you must excuse my apron. We have been selling these since morning. You haven't been there for such a long time. Sit down. Won't you have some nuts? No, I already had some. But what's that? You are there in evening dress. Though I must say, you look better. What had made you got up like that? Actually, the fact is that I have made up my mind to ask you to hear me out. <coughs> well, what's the matter? As you know, yours family and my family have very good terms from a long time. And my oxen meadows touch your bosoms. Excuse my interrupting you. You say my oxen meadows. But are they yours? Yes, mine. No, they are ours. They are mine. Ours. Mine. Ours. Mine. Ours. Mine. Don't shout. I will shout. My heart. My heart. Water. I need some water. Huh? Water. <coughs> Just think, Ivan, how long they have been yours. How long? As long as I can remember. If you don't believe me, I can show you the documents. I cannot make head or tail of what you're talking about. What a surprise! The oxen meadows are mine. No, they are ours. They are mine. Ours. I'll prove it to you. They are ours. Okay, if you need them so badly, I can give them to you. The oxen meadows are ours. How can you give them to me? Mine. Ours. Mine. Ours. Mine. 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 What is it? What are you shouting at? Papa, see. He says the oxen meadows are his. But the oxen meadows are ours. The oxen meadows are ours, my precious. No, they are mine. They are ours. Mine. Ours. Mine. And I'll prove it to you. You won't prove anything, my precious. I shall. You won't prove anything just by yelling. Papa, send the most to the meadows this very day. I'll break your necks. What are you doing to my daughter? The oxen meadows are mine. They are ours. Mine. Ours. You're in trigger. What did you say? You're in trigger. You are a double-faced, malicious, double-crossing scoundrel. All of your family is a land rebel. All, all, all. <coughs> you think I'm a land grabber? <coughs> yes, you are a land grabber. Everybody knows about your reputation. Your family's reputation. Your mother is a land grabber, your father is a land grabber, your grandmother, grandmother, everybody's a land grabber. And you are also a land grabber. Madam, in my life, I have never ever grabbed anyone else's land. Well, you are grabbing ours right now. The oxen meadows are mine. <sighs> the oxen meadows are ours and get lost from my house. Don't set foot in my house again! <coughs> that scoundrel, 
that blind hen came here to propose to you. Propose to me? Yeah, propose to you. Fetch him back. Fetch him back. What are you talking about? Fetch him back. Oh, such an unhappy man am I. I'll hang myself. I'll shoot myself. Lumo, my son. Lumo, come back. Lumo, come back. Lumo. Talk to him. I can't. <coughs> The oxen meadows are mine. The land isn't worth more to me. I return principles. The oxen meadows are yours. Let's talk about something else. When are you going for the shooting? I'll be going after the harvest. Do you know my dog Roxy? He's become lame. What a pity. What happened? Must be bitten by some other dog. I paid 125 rubles for him. Very expensive. But he's a first grade dog. You know, Papa gave 85 rubles for Squeezer. And Squeezer is far better than your Roxy. Squeezer better than Roxy? Yes, he is. <coughs> Are you joking? Squeezer is better than your Roxy. Squeezer's lower jaw is smaller than his upper jaw. Have you majored? Your dog is mad. Your dog is mad. Now what are you shouting at? Tell him that Squeezer is better than Roxy. But isn't Roxy better? Well, don't excite yourself much. Squeezer is far better than your Roxy. Your Roxy is so slow at muscles. Roxy is better. <coughs> He's worse than a Squeezer. I know. Everybody knows. Your ex-wife used to beat you with a stick. I am not you interfere in my matters. Shut up! Look, he's dead. Who's dead? Lumov. What are you talking about? Bring water. Lumov! Lumov! Wake up, Lumov! 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 Drink water. Lumov! Roxy better than Squeezer. Roxy better than Squeezer. Okay, now we both just marry. She is willing. And let me be in peace. Yes, yes, I'm willing. Roxy is better than Squeezer. Worse, worse, worse. Better, better, better. Worse, worse, worse. Better, better, better. Worse, better, worse, better. Champagne, champagne, champagne.